Um, interesting news um, from HTST, uh, kind of the, the hard drive manufacturer, uh, which is a subset of Western Digital, which kind of used to be, well, I guess it went from IBM to, um, boy, I can't even remember the name it went to after that to uh, HTST. It's been a long time. Essentially, UltraStar drives, the HE10, a 10 terabyte helium filled drive. The article's up on the Inquirer. This thing's a beast. Um, Quote, one of the things that we're seeing is that modern data centers are rarely ambient. They can be hotter, drier, colder, or more harsh in terms of contamination in their environments. Uh, and they claim that it can operate. Basically, uh, they're, they're claiming it can operate anywhere, even underwater, uh, as it is encased in a microclimate, uh, which is something we're very familiar with uh, here in uh, Northern California. And the idea that if you drive a mile, the temperature can go up 10 degrees, drop 20 degrees. You can go from rain to fog to... Uh, to apparently the inside of a hard drive that doesn't change. So um, this is uh, not their, it, it's, they've shipped like 4 million 10 terabyte drives, they're saying in the article, uh, Western Digital saying, uh, Brendan Collins, their vice president of hard disk drive product marketing, um, that does their sort of shingling, overlapping magnetic tracks. Um, but they, uh quote, tended to be more reliable in the environments because of the sealed nature of the product. 56% um, fewer terabytes per watt than an air-filled drive and can operate anywhere even under water. So first 10 terabyte helium-filled drive for general purpose data use, uh, currently being sampled, will be available early in 2016 as part of the Active Archive Petabyte Scale-Out team. So they've been doing 6 gigabyte and 8 gigabyte versions, and the 10 terabyte version is new.